Well, our relationship with France has been a sort of downward spiral ever since we voted to leave the EU. You, you, you know, you'll recall that throughout the negotiations over leaving the European Union, it was the French that really coined the desire to, to punish the United Kingdom for voting to leave. And things have just got progressively worse since we've left. Um, the first manifestation of, of the deterioration of our relationship was in fishing, and we see that that's continuing, even though the French fishermen have got 40% of the 1,700 licenses issued to fish in our territorial waters. Um, and this latest thing over the uh, Ill illegal immigrants coming across the channel, well, again, that is squarely down to the French. We have a, we have a bilateral agreement with France pursuant to which we pay them and have paid them over the last few years £200 million, and I think we pay them about £50 million a year, in order to prevent this practice. And they observe that agreement fragrantly in the breach, with French policemen walking up and down their beaches, you know, just watching these crafts being launched. So the failure here, I think, is not really in um, the French-British relationship, which has been in this downward spiral for a long time. The failure here is of the British government not recognising that we don't have a workable relationship with France and not taking unilateral action to get to grips with these problems.